just be out with us for a bucket list snorkeling tour here at Keycocker in Belize. Today we are going to make six snorkeling uh, stops and one sightseeing stop. We are going to Hol Chan, Shark Ray Alley. We are going uh, to see a shipwreck. Yes, we're going to see the manatee and fingers coral crossed. Go gardens. Yes, fingers crossed. And of course, we're going to go see turtles and they have a bonus where we get to feed the tarpons. We chose to go with the caveman tour because they are the best on the island. And if you've been following us, you know, we only refer you to the best tours and activities. Absolutely. And caveman tours have five star reviews on the TripAdvisor. And we walked around the island. There are actually over 50 different tours we spoke mm -hmm. with different tours Company. agents mm -hmm. and some of them uh, have uh, halfway half day tours some of them have full day tours like we're going on right now but mm -hmm. not all the tours will take you to all seven stops so to get the most bang for your buck you would definitely want to do something like this where in one shot one full day you get to cover it all that Keycocker has to offer. Let's go get fitted and just, just be, be out, out with, with us. us. We just got fitted with our gear and now a word from the caveman himself. Okay, my brothers and sisters, have no fear, the caveman is here. And have no fear, the caveman team is here to show you guys a very excellent day today. I just want to let the people know how I work. My number one priority for the customers is respect. Respect for the customer, respect for the environment, safety, being honest, and show everybody a hell of a good time. My goal is, is to try my utmost best, my team, to make sure you guys are happier, right? And if you're happier and you know it, when you come back, what you do, you clap your hands, all right? I'm ready to clap. Uh, uh, amen, amen, <laughs> amen, all right. We just got fitted and we're getting ready to board. And before we do that, you all want to know how much it all costs. So the full day tour costs 90 US dollars per person and they leave at 10.30 a.m. And that's one of the benefits if you are not an early morning person or maybe you went out partying the night before. So it's really good that you actually get to sleep in, you have time to have your breakfast and head out for the tour. So the tour also includes your lunch. And this is another reason why we chose Caveman Tour is because they actually give you a really uh, wide variety of things that you can choose for your lunch. You can choose burger, uh, rice, beans, and chicken, or maybe rice and vegetables if you are a vegetarian. Uh, you can choose fish burger. So they also provide you soft drinks. Uh, the park fee, yes. Hold Chan is a marine reserve and you do have to pay park fee so other tourists might give you a cheaper price but the fee for the park is not covered and here you get your snorkeling gear you have your lunch also fruits and water and also they do cover the park fee so uh, that's really beneficial for us because we don't want to be worried about paying different prices so one thing you do need to know that the manatees are not guaranteed for you to see they are of course wild animals and caveman tours do the best to actually go look for them while you're on a full day snorkeling tour the season for manatees is june through november manatees are warm water creatures so they like warm water like me <laughs> and once the water begins getting cooler they actually go out and look for warmer water snorkeling with nurse sharks has been on my bucket list for a very long time well since i actually snorkeled with real sharks in hawaii and i'm really excited for this tour so let's get on the boat and head out snorkeling Our 
first stop on this trip is the bonus stop and we are on the west side of Kikakar. If you have seen our full walkthrough of the Kikakar tour, we actually brought you here. And yes, if you're not on the tour, you still can come and feed the tarpoons. Tarpoons are huge fishes and they actually grow up to 300 pounds. And if you, uh, the fishes here are actually babies. They are being bred here in the mangrove area and they hang out here because there is a fresh water lagoon. So the popular attraction here on Kikaka is tarpoon feeding. Let's go get sardines and feed these babies. These are sardines and the best way to feed the tarpoon is to have your hands super flat. You put the sardine between your thumb and the rest of your fingers and you kind of wait for them to jump out. Much fun, and now we're heading to search for manatees. creature. <laughs> ago because of the bad weather and all the corals that are growing right on top of it are literally 40 years old and here there's another area where we get a chance to see a manatee let's jump in Marine Reserve. This is the oldest reserve in Belize. It's been uh, protected for over 35 years and there are actually specific rules to snorkel here. We have to go in together as a group with our guide. You have to pay a fee normally to snorkel here. It is 20 Belize dollars per person for tourists but our tour actually included the fee here and we are 
right next to the barrier reef. Hol Chan, from, uh, in translation from Mayan, means a passage or channel. It is marked with buoys for boats to go in and out of the reserve and go through the reef safely. Right now, I already see massive fishes. These fishes are already used to tourists coming in. And again, uh, this area is protected. The fishes grow bigger because they are protected here. As we were given a little briefing here, we already saw a turtle. So this is the best area for snorkeling here in Belize. Let's dive in. Uh, we had about 45 minutes to an hour snorkeling time here at Hol Chan. Let me tell you, just this alone is it's worth definitely it. worth 150%. it. 150%. We saw so many schools of fishes. I was actually practicing free diving and I dove right into the, them, the school of fishes and they don't even move. They are so used to people here. And the fishes are just so many different varieties and there are so many of them. Yeah, it's it's awesome. The stingrays, oh my gosh, they're just gliding through they're the waters. They're just flying inside the water and they go right onto you. Oh my God, the turtles here, they just come right <laughs> next come right to, you. to you. It's crazy. We, in Hawaii, we're used to the law of staying 10, ten feet away from the turtle. But here, the turtles just come, they come right to you. next to you. It is yeah. insane. But actually, one of my favorite parts of this was actually as we were snorkeling over the coral. It was literally, yes. it's like being like in the Grand Canyon of corals. Yes, that was amazing. I really love the shallow part as well. And uh, I'm actually really proud of you that you went out That's snorkeling cool, yeah. and um, about, seems do the damn to be thing. getting used to snorkeling. Yeah, sure. Now our next stop is lunch. <laughs> Let's dig in. Thanks. Another awesome feature caveman tour offers is that actually you can choose your lunch options normally in other tours if you're lucky to get lunch you only get in chicken rice and beans but here you can choose between beef um, fish burger chicken rice and beans or vegetables and rice i got chicken rice and beans and it also comes with a salad look it looks bomb smells delicious too and you can actually have soda as well we just finished our lunch it was delicious and now we are here to the one of the best parts of the tour is snorkeling with nurse sharks I can already see them swirl around the boat 
So there are two places uh, here not too far from Kikaka where you can snorkel. Right now we are on the North Channel and this is a part of Hol Chan Reserve and it's been protected for over 35 years. Uh, this nurse sharks do not have any predators. That's why in this area nurse sharks grow actually bigger. They grow up to 12 feet. But there is another spot, uh, if you go um, for a half day tour, they'll take you to the south side and you can also snorkel with sharks there. The water is shallow there, you can actually stand. Here you cannot stand, but the sharks over there are much smaller. They go up to only five feet because that part of the area has been protected for only 10 years. So the sharks are not as big there. So let's jump in. now at the coral garden this area is actually outside of the reserve area so the fishermen come here to fish so there is not as much colorful fishes but it's still supposed to be beautiful corals Wow, the coral garden name speaks for itself. It's literally a garden underneath. All the coral formations are insane. The, most of the corals look brown, but the formations are so crazy. There is not that much fish there, but I found a school of blue and probably like blue and black I don't even know what color but mostly blue and I was just swimming along them and it was truly magical Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you.
Wow, 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 what a day. It was an insane experience. I finally saw manatees since we've been in Belize. If we, you saw our previous vlogs, I've been dying to see a manatee. And it's actually the season is almost over for manatees. And it was so giant and peaceful. And it was when I was snorkeling next to it, it was just looking at me and it was crazy. And the sharks, oh yeah, my God. Just like... And there was a shark that was at least 10 feet in length. Yes, they crazy. were massive. They look so weird because obviously nurse sharks and the front of their, their mouths come like very thin and then they their mouths are at the very bottom with like little whiskers. Uh, but the way they swim, they swim just like real oh, sharks. sharks. Yeah. And, and as I was snorkeling, so uh, there are tours that don't feed the sharks and there are tours that do. So caveman tours do feed the sharks. And as you can see, the sharks are just all around the boat. But once they stop feeding the sharks, they just go mm -hmm. to the next boat. Mm -hmm. So they say uh, the tours that don't feed the sharks they they still say the sharks are still there they come to the boat so they come to check out the boat quickly so if there is no feeding yeah, they quickly they swim yeah, away they don't, they don't to the next around. boat but as you snorkel around you see a few sharks passing by you mm -hmm. so if you really want that experience where a lot of sharks just all around you definitely choose a tour where they do feed the sharks so to, cavemen to, uh, tours, tours do, do do feed the sharks so but to be clear the way it's done they uh put they throw sardines on one side of the boat and then you have to exit the boat from the other end and they tell you specifically you swim around and you stay within six to ten feet away from the where they're feeding them you don't want to go right in the middle where all the sharks yeah. are having the feeding frenzy so you stay on the kind of like the outskirts mm -hmm. of them feeding and you're able to see them you're not allowed mm -hmm. to pet them and hold them if you do see that in any of the videos that you might have probably watched here on YouTube uh, technically you really shouldn't do that that's not cool so don't expect to come here and that's what's going to happen or that's what you will experience because technically you're not supposed to touch the sharks at all this was the best snorkeling tour I've ever ever done mm -hmm. it was insane definitely bucket list mm -hmm. all checked out tarpoon feeding so much so fun cool. bird so cool. feeding so much fun yes. and they actually feed you as well on the tour the food <laughs> oh, yeah, was the food really was good bomb. that belizean uh, stew chicken rice and bean salad no you can't beat it so absolutely great 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 exper experience definitely 150 percent jbo approved so be sure to check out caveman tours uh, take a look at their trip advisor don't just take our word for it mm -hmm. they are all top notch five star reviews and be sure to book in advance it is 90 us dollars for a full day of snorkeling it is 100 percent worth it mm -hmm. and their guides are very knowledgeable so when you're out there they're giving you a lot of information on the fishes while you're snorkeling they'll dive all the way to the bottom and they'll show you what corals are what what fishes are what and they're actually pointing at it while you're snorkeling and you're just looking down and seeing them it, it's just all in all it's the best and uh one one big decision that you'll have to make when coming here and going on a snorkeling excursion is whether you should do a half day or full day we highly recommend the full day it is absolutely worth it you bang everything out in one day all seven stops you get to do it all and that's it and you know one thing it is our last day here today and if it wasn't and if it would be a good day we'd go again yes hundred percent i would definitely go again guys it's so much i love it see. that much yeah really 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 great so if you haven't seen any of our other videos here while we're in belize the link will be in the description or just click on this video right here and it'll take you to other videos that we have published here in belize so as usual thank you for watching and just, just be, be out, out with, with us, us.